the following video may contain sensitive topics. The views and opinions of the presenter to these are plainly his own. Furthermore, any and all views and opinions of the presenter do not, in any way, reflect the views, opinions, statements, and advocacy of his personal contacts, his family, his affiliations, and his profession. While the presenter makes a commitment that all content is original, he is obliged to cite references or acknowledge resources mentioned or used in the production of this video. This disclaimer is also written in the description below. I am trying to uh, record myself uh, using the uh, the camera uh, attached to this, I know, to this, um, uh, to the computer that I'm using to record, but then again, it crashes every single time, and I don't fucking know why. Hindi naman siya ganito. And uh, the camera itself wasn't uh, designed to uh, uh, limit itself to 5 to 10 minutes of uh, video recording, so I don't really know what the hell's going on with that, but hey, you know, I'll just deal with it. Uh, I'll just deal with myself uh, just... Uh, having my voice and um, actually this is much more uh, you know this is much more uh, comfortable on my end because I don't have to project myself in uh, in front of a camera and I can still do uh, my commentary even though hindi nyo ako nakikita so uh, I guess uh, in lieu of uh, myself uh Myself on talking heads mode, I might just uh, display my logo as uh, in intervals every time I pause the video uh, for this uh, for this uh, salty reaction. Yes, this is gonna be a salty reaction, and it's about the Mandela catalog again, which is basically one of my autistic hyperfixations. I don't know why, but uh, yeah. Let's get on with it. Oh shit. Here we go again. Ladies and gentlemen, from its studio south of Manila, IJR Productions presents The Intrepid Show. Hi, I'm Ian Rinon, an independent alternative media practitioner, among other things. And welcome to another episode of The Intrepid Show. And just a salty reaction where commentaries need an extra dose of salt. You might notice that I do not have any video at this point. It's because the camera is fucked. And I'm not gonna risk doing the forbidden te technique. Yung pinagbabawa na technique na uh, nakasync yung ano, yung uh, sa, sa cellphone ko. Because uh, I am using my phone right now as, uh, as, my browsing, uh, as my browsing device. Because, yeah... Uh, I have to stay online. That's for sure. Anyway, before we tackle, uh, before we tackle uh, uh, our video today, and uh, I would just like to uh, provide a little, uh, some updates regarding uh, regarding this channel as well as my um, future plans. Now, I have to scale down um, significantly. Uh, this year kasi marami na rin akong mga ina inasikasong plano and those are a little bit secret as, as of the moment so uh, I hope you would understand uh, kung bakit ano kung bakit hindi ako masyadong nag-upload secondly uh, the reason why I'm not uploading that much is because uh, you know it's also um, part of my uh, part of the stuff that I've been tackling about regarding my mental health because uh, as you may know in um, my Autism in the Philippines uh, uh, videos or uh, video series, I suspect myself to be autistic. So, that's that. Kumbaga, nandu pa ako sa process na uh, papano ko tatanggapin to sa sarili ko and how, would, how on earth would I, uh, would I deal with myself uh, uh, suspecting myself to be autistic and uh, how can I get officially diagnosed for that uh, for that matter so that's that thirdly uh, 
uh, dun sa Autism in the Philippines uh, video series at uh, buti sinegway ko to, uh, I would have to, ano, I would have to uh, add an additional part regarding that. Uh, part 4 uh, and uh, uh, previously, the uh, part 3 would be uh, the uh, Autistic Coded Eraserhead songs. That's gonna be part 4 now. Part 3 would be my open letter or um, my uh, uh, my honest uh, my honest uh, natin, ano, message to uh, parents of autistic children or parents of autistic Filipino children. So I guess I would have to uh, deal with that as well. So yun lang naman. Also, this is gonna be uh, the final uh, edited video. Uh, for this first half of 2022 kasi as I said uh, marami ako mga pinaplano sa buhay as well as uh, I would also like to uh, include if not transition maybe include na lang talaga kasi gusto ko rin naman ding gawin yung mga gantong classing video din and uh, bas- basically this channel is uh, and anything goes so yun lang naman so I would love to uh, include cycling vlogs in uh in this channel kasi medyo hyper fixated din ako doon and um sarap kayo magbike yun lang masasabi ko and uh kaya lang ang magiging focus ko uh instead of ano instead of uh the cycling uh process is is the destiny or the destinations the destinations yung mga lugar na pinapadyakan ko so uh if if you have uh Kasi we we already have uh, cycling vloggers such as Ian Howe and the rest of Team Apple, Ira Lopez, uh, uh, Jer Victor, Jay Katigbak, uh, Zar Lim, Eloisa Regaliza, Angelo Biker Dude, uh, and the uh, all the other you know cycl- uh, cyclist vloggers that are basically recording uh, their rides. Medyo nahihiya din ako dun sa ano sa sa part na yun. Kaya, mas gusto ko sana na doon ako sa part na ano, na nandun na ako sa destination na yun at nagre-record na ako regarding doon sa uh, pinuntahan ko. So, more I'm more on the historical and cultural side of uh, the cycling spectrum para naman may, para naman maiba yung ano ko. Maiba naman yung content ko uh, uh, doon sa mga cyc- uh, cycling vloggers. I would, st- I still appreciate their, um, their work kasi nga naman, they have the equipment they have the money and uh eventually i would also love to ano i would also love to uh uh record snippets of me uh riding the bicycle itself uh, actually na po, yung actually na pumapadyak ako i would love to do that kaya lang i do not have the equipment just yet so si segue ko na to sa ano sa mga paraan ko paano niyo ako masusuportahan in order for me to uh get into those goals so uh, if you're that generous, I would, I would very much uh, invite you to, so uh, to uh, donate through my um through my online pat- platforms on Patreon, buy me a co- coffee, Ko-Fi, or PayPal. All the links to them are in the description below. But then again, this is ano uh, volunteer, uh, this is voluntary, hindi siya mandatory. Kung hindi nyo kaya, okay lang. Okay lang naman sa akin. It's not uh, no, it's not a big deal. But uh, if you would like to uh, help me get to that without uh, without spending money, uh, you can basically like this video and share this video around. Subscribe to my channel. Ring the notification bell by selecting all. And uh, maybe, just maybe, if you um, if uh, there would be a lot of likes in this video, uh, Alex Kister might. Uh, <laughs> be surprised that there is a Filipino who would uh, uh, who is uh, diving deep into his work in the Mandela catalog so let's um hindi man sa nag-ambition ako but why not diba <laughs> yun lang naman ang masasabi ko why not so uh i hope you would be uh, you would help me out on that again if you're uh if you're financially capable I would also appreciate it if you would donate through Patreon, buy me a coffee, Ko-Fi, or PayPal. All the links to that 
are also in the description below. Um, while you're at it, I'm also in Strava. I'm also on Strava. You can follow me. Uh, my name in on Strava. Uh, my name on Strava is uh, Intrepid Ian Rinyon. Uh, you can also follow. Uh, you can also check out my previous rides. Uh, there, sa Strava. So, uh, yun lang naman yung sa akin. So, uh, with all that said, let's get on with the video. And as you may uh, notice, eh, medyo ano tayo, medyo mapapa-analog horror tayo. Specifically, the Mandela Catalog. Kasi na-mention ko na rin si Alex Kister. This is basically his longest, uh, uh, his latest longest work. And it's called Volume 333. Now, this is not his latest kasi meron din siyang um, parang aftermath video called Every Day Gets Brighter. But then again, it's uh, it's an aftermath video of what happened in Volume 333. So, yun lang naman yung sakin. And uh, if you want to check out the Mandela Catalog or you want to know the context of the whole story of the Mandela Catalog, I recommend, I highly recommend that you go to Alex Kister's channel, watch all of the videos uh, in his channel from Overthrown to Volume 333 para malaman ninyo yung buong context. Kasi, uh, baka, ito, spoiler alert, magre-refer ako sa mga ibang mga ano niya, yung mga ibang uh, videos niya, yung mga previous, mga previous videos niya, and you might not understand it. But then again, uh, A little bit of a background. So, Man- the Mandela Catalog is basically uh, a horror series uh, which presents an alternate, rea- an alternate reality uh, where uh, the forces of evil were victorious in uh, distorting religion in general. So, basically, uh, it's... It's gonna. You know, it's. It's a wicked world, and uh, medyo na it it sends chills down to my spine. Na yung ano y- sa ano na yon yung kwento na yon, and I thank God that he still prevails in our ano in our reality. But in Alex Kister's reality, man, it's so twisted. Yun lang naman na masasabi ko. So again, this is an alternate reality. It's not happening in real life, but it. Gives you that kind of ano, that kind of perspective na ganun pala kakapang kamakapangyarihan, ganun pala ka, ganun pala ang kapangyarihan ng ano ng mga demonyo sa ano sa mundo natin at sa mundo ni Alex Kister. And uh, with that, let's let us before we start this video, let us pray the prayer to Saint Michael. Saint Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our defense against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Hosts, by the power of God, thrust into hell Satan and all evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. And with that said, let's start the Mandela Catalog, Volume 333. And we're starting in 3... Two, one, go. Okay, so this is basically an overview. Akala ko nga dati, ano to eh, uh, <laughs> parody siya ng Warner Brothers uh, intro. And that's the video from, uh, okay. that's the house okay. from Intruder oh, Alert. Honey. Oh, wait lang. So um So, etong ano na to, etong <laughs> eto eksena na to. Basically, it's from Intruder Alert. So uh doon pa na sa uh, sa harapan ng bahay. It's the house from Intruder Alert and then you see the empty crib and a mother and a child who's crying who's not there. So, <laughs> my goodness. It sends chills down my spine. Kasi, um, to give you a context about Intruder Alert, uh, basically, it's about uh, 
uh, a child who was uh, who was kidnapped by a man on the TV, which we call the Intruder. And uh, the Mandela Catalog subreddit calls Six. I am not sure kung bakit, but basically he's called Six. So uh, I might interchange uh, the uh, the name fr- uh, from Intruder to Six and vice versa. Pero it's the same guy. So yun lang naman yung sabi ko. So basically, siya yung nag-kidnap sa mga batang yun. And uh, kahit na nakidnap siya, eh, namimik pa rin or naririnig pa rin ng nanay yung iyak ng, ano niya, ng anak niya. Although wala na siya dun sa crib. So, uh, distraught at the sight of her missing infant, the mother oofed himself. Oofed herself, rather. <laughs> Goodness gracious me. Yon. And uh yun nga, yun yung ano, yun yung basically yung kwento ng intruder alert. So at least you are aware about the context of this first part of volume 333. Let's continue. Yep. Hey. Hey, what's up? You started crying again. Same time. Ooh. I don't know what to do. I'm sorry. I, I I just don't know how to help you anymore. Are you absolutely sure it's not the... No. No, I, I keep telling you. It's not... I've had it implode for weeks now. Whoa! Wait lang, I wait mean... lang, wait lang, wait! <laughs> yeah! The theories are right! The mother who was distraught at the sight of her missing infant was Adam Murray's mother, Lynn. <laughs> Goodness gracious me. I mean, uh, dun sa volume 2 kasi, dun sa heightened, ano, or climax nung, ano, nung conversation ni na, ano, Adam Murray at Jonah Marshall, uh, na-mention ni Jonah na, I wish we never looked for your because she is dead and gone and we were never gonna get her back. What did you just fucking say to me? Yun yung, ano, yun yung sinabi niya. And, uh, that blank something, it might be, ano, it might be uh, Adam's mother or sister, basta babae. But this proves it. <laughs> because Adam, Adam's name is Adam Murray. And basically, Jude and Lynn Murray are his parents. And Lynn Murray is the mo- mother who was distraught at the sight of her missing infant who oofed herself in Intruder Alert. So, uh, sabi ga nila, it all interconnects. <laughs> so, yun lang naman yun. So, basically, as you see in here in this, ano, in his, uh, in this snapshot, uh, Jude and Lynn divorced after two years of marriage. And uh, it just so happened that the divorce happened in 1992. Uh, so basically, it's the time of volume one. Now, divorce per se in the Philippine context is a little bit of a, a different topic for another day. Pero para sa context ng ano ng volume three three three, um, uh, importante na malaman natin yung context na to kasi 1992 is where the alternates began their uh. Sabi na natin ano in Tagalog. Uh, nagsimulang maghasik ng lagem ang mga alternates noong 1992. So, yun lang naman yung nangyari doon. And, uh, in the real world, in our current reality, I was born in 1992. Today is the 22nd of June, ni- uh, 2022. And in six months, I am turning 30. So, yeah. Perfect segue. <laughs> yun lang naman yung sa akin. Anyway, let's continue with the video. Go. Guess I can come over and help you figure it out. Are you free tomorrow night? Tomorrow night? You promise you'll actually come over this time? Ooh. He's still your child too, you know. I swear to God, Lynn, <laughs> if this is just an imaginary friend or something, I'm gonna lose it. Yeah, uh, argument, uh... What do you mean? Do you realize how young he is? Ah, yun tayo eh. I think that... So it'd be so overpopulated that there will be wars. All nuclear explosions. Wait, Greta Thunberg, ba yun na rin ko don? At kaniyang matato. And let the good Lord worry about tomorrow. 
Don't tell me it's Lynn Murray's eyes here. What about us? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Talaga nilagay ni Alex Kister yung ano, eksen, isang eksena sa Casablanca. <laughs> anyway, uh, I don't know how on earth uh, did I... Uh, that I knew from the get-go, nung una, nung, kasi pin-review ko tong, ano, etong panonood ko ng volume 33, at nalaman ko, uh, right off the bat, that this was a scene from Casablanca. <laughs> Goodness gracious me. <laughs> Yun ang masasabi ko. Alex, you're a man of culture. Yun ang masasabi ko. Anyway, let's continue. Go. We'll always have Paris. We'll always have Paris. <laughs> Speed hundreds of telephone calls as well as television programs. Yeah. Ominous sounds. And then the eyes. And we start off. Volume 333. <laughs> Nothing but enlightening, to say the least. I learned a lot about myself and how my colleagues in the room have learned about me as well. The promotion of I Sergeant. Stand down for my base values, no matter how far up the ladder I go. Ruth Weaver. Well, I may not be the most um, a spoken type. I protect and serve my city with pride, and I'm and Lieutenant. Thank you all. Thatcher Davis. Wait lang. Um, okay. So, the hall is called Moriah Hall. And I think Moriah is also biblical. Ano? It's also a biblical. It, it, uh, tayto, uh, <laughs> naka ano siya. Uh, it's also sa, uh, a place that is, it's a, it's a biblical place. I am not sure kung saan yun, pero, uh, it's from the Old Testament, probably. And, um, napansin ko lang na yung saludo nung ano, nung nagsalita ay eh, nasa kaliwang kamay for some reason. Uh, it's not a mirror image. Parang naka, naka left hand salute. So, what is going on? <laughs> what is going on? Yun lang naman yung sa akin. Kasi, the only time that uniformed personnel can render a left hand salute is if their right hand is, uh, uh, is incapacitated to do so. Case in point, former uh, former Armed Forces of the Philippines Chief of Staff General uh, Sirito Sobehana, who is uh, who was also the highest ranking Medal of Valor recipient. So uh, basically, he got his uh, Medal of Valor when he was still a junior officer back in 2000. Na na incapacitate yung kamay niya but instead of ano but instead of uh, amputating it eh uh, kumbaga uh, he hinayaan niya na hinayaan niyang nakadangle pa rin yung ano yung kamay niya dun sa ano sa katawan niya and he had uh, he had no choice but to render left hand salutes so that's the only time that you, uh, that a uniformed uh, personnel that uniformed personnel can render left hand salutes so yun lang naman yung sa akin again Sorry sa ano, sorry sa segue but uh medyo nag, nagtaka lang ako dun sa ano sa kung bakit left hand salute yung nakita ko dun sa video na to. Anyway, let's get back. Okay. Ano man to? Hello, no one is available to take your call. Please leave a message after the tone. Please don't. <laughs> officer, uh, one of our students, Mark Heathcliff, Whoa. absent for the past couple days. So basically, this is from the school where Mark Heathcliff, Heathcliff um, uh, studied. So basically, they were concerned about if Mark Heathcliff. Have Heathcliff. Pay a visit to, um, uh, three... Okay, I'm so make sure everything's all right. Parang ni-redact yung ano, yung address. If someone could try to get the contact info for whoever enters the door, that would be much appreciated. Uh, thank you. Have a nice night. 
Toot. Wait lang. Toot. Okay. So, uh, if you if you remember Volume One, you have Mark Mark Heathcliff. So basically, uh, this was played by Alex Kister himself. Uh, and uh, yun nga, uh, siya yung ano, siya yung naging focus sa Volume One. Now, uh, if you watched vo- uh, Mandela Catalog Volume One, uh, he received Mark Heathcliff received a call from uh, from his friend Caesar Torres, and uh, not knowing that uh, it's already an alternate of Caesar Torres uh, luring Mark to their house, uh, and then uh, latching on to him. Uh, at uh, yun nga, tinorment nga si Mark Heathcliff uh, to the point that he had a gun and, um, you know, he tried to shoot it before uh, pointing the barrel to his uh, to his temple. So, yun yung nangyari. And uh, maraming, ano, maraming undertones ng Volume 1 ang makita natin in the next few scenes here in Volume 333. So, yun lang naman yung sakin. Let's get back to the video. Okay. So basically, they're back and they're now going uh, to Mark Heathcliff's house. The police, that is. And probably the one who's uh, the one who is uh, going to get inside is Lieutenant Davis himself, because. Siya ang nag-investigate. Open up. Yeah, siya yung nag-investigate dun sa, ano, sa pagkamatay ni Mark Heathcliff dun sa exhibition. Police, open the door! FBI, open up! <laughs> <laughs> Heathcliff versus alternate altercation. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Oh. <laughs> Baka may lobas na ano ah, alternate gen na Ringu. Oh, Shiza. Oh, Shiza. <laughs> That's the corpse of Mark Heathcliff. <laughs> Tapos pala art alternate yung ano, yung babae sa Ringu. Mark Heathcliff, 17, died September 21, 1992. Nobody came for him. <laughs> Ah, uh, shit, ang daming basyo ng bala ya. Daming basyo ng bala. Ano yan, 9 mil or 45? Parang 45 eh. Hindi, hindi 45 kasi pito lang ang uh, 7 plus 1 lang ang ano, ang capacity ng magazine ng ano, ng 45. 7 in the mag, 1 in the chamber. O, oh, bakit may bukas na TV na naka-static? Baka lobas yung Ringu na alternate dyan. <laughs> Sada, sa, 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 si Sadako pala yung, alternate pala si Sadako, no? <laughs> okay, so may tape recorder, may Biblia, and then there's a notebook entitled Reassurances? Reassurances. God bless all. Okay. You do realize you just got promoted, right? You don't have to work on this bullshit case anymore. Listen. Bullshit. I got the <laughs> bullshit case. Okay. It's got some evidence to review. So still. basically, okay. that's a uh, conversation between Lieutenant Davis and Sergeant Weaver. All right. Lock the door on the way out. Okay. Who's this guy? This might be Caesar Torres or his alternate. Pero parang hindi siya eh, kasi ano eh iba yung ano itsura ni Caesar Torres sa volume 1 eh. Yun ang masabi ko. And the 
fingerprints were present on the doorknob of course kasi nga naman minimimik nila pati yung ano yung uh, hand features so yun lang naman and you have Mark Heathcliff with a picture uh, with um, acted out by Alex Kister himself so yeah and they are present on the handgun the cassette player and the notebook as well as the camcorder all of them were collected for investigation so magsimula lang tayo magsimula sila dun sa camcorder and uh yung tape found in the camcorder says shadow under the door okay this is interesting. Okay. Kumakatok yung alternate sa labas ng pintuan ng kwarto ni Mark. Ah, oh, shizen! Nagla-levitate yung alternate? Ang <laughs> bilis ng katok! Tut -tut 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 And then the cassette player. Ooh, this is nice. Voices outside my room. He needs to open the door. No. I am not going away. <laughs> Wait long. <laughs> Shiza. <laughs> Naalala ko tuloy yung ano, yung gameplay sa Mandela Invasion. <laughs> yung <laughs> Hello, open the door. I am I have a surprise for you. you, you, you. Tsaka yun. Surprise. <laughs> yung may glitch sa bosses. Tsaka sa volume 1 din may glitch din ng konti dun sa ano, sa bosses nung alternate uh, Caesar. <laughs> sa ano sa volume 1. So again, uh tinatahi natin yung ano, yung mga eksena sa volume 1 at dito sa volume 333. So let's get back to the video. Don't worry about the time. You have loads of time. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ato, mga alternates nag-uusap sa, nag -usap -usap sa isa't isa? Man, that's creepy. This is also creepy. I mean, lots of alternates outside the room. <laughs> nag-uusap -usap lang. What the hell's going on? Is that a party or something? And then the notebook. Eto. Okay, so we read a lot of uh, stuff here. Uh, Pinos ko lang. So, sinabi dito, God loves me unconditionally. Always remember that no matter the circumstance, God loves all of us simply because He has chosen to do so. He loves the universe. Everyone else loves me. I am at peace. So, uh, dito pa lang parang. Uh, Nagtitiwala siya sa Diyos. But in the, in the world of Alex Kister, God was overthrown. Uh, overthrown and overthrown. So, may wordplay nga dun sa word na overthrown sa pin, na pinakaunang video ni Alex Kister. So, at least you have an idea or uh, have an, uh, an additional context regarding that. So, let's get back to playing this one. Okay. Today is a day that I need God's love more than anything. I am alone and I need to feel the warmth of His love and reassurance. I am alone! <laughs> oh, Command and Conquer reference. Command and Conquer General's reference. 
is not the only one. My lord, I am afraid. I beg for your love and protection against evil. Okay. So, dito, pa, dito na, dito na nag, ano, nag, ano yung utak ni Mark Keith. Wait lang, wait lang. Uh, I have no choice anymore. The cops never came for me. Nobody came for me. Whoever is reading this, please stop before it does, th it does this to anyone else. Okay. Tapos, let's get back to the video. Did, who have I who have I been praying to all this time? Who have I been praying to all this time? Who have been praying to all this time? Who have been I've been praying to all this time? Who have I been praying to all this time? Who have been I've been praying to all this time? Who have I I've been praying to all this time? Ugh. Ay. Wow. My eyes are wide open. You fucking bastard! So yeah. Ooh, alternate report. Caesar Torres may display human in in human features. Ah, Shiza. Na lalo ko tuloy sa my eyes are wide open. Na lalo ko parang ano lang. Pagkatapos doon, para ilalagay ko na sa post prod yung ano, yung uh, you fucking bastard. Das bang. So naman, Murray versus alternate art altercation, evidence real. Okay. And now we are dealing with Mandela Tech, Tech Daily. All right, Mr. Davis. Wait, lang, teka, teka. Uh, <laughs> so basically, Alex Kister also portrayed Dave Lee. <laughs> Goodness gracious me. Ah, uh, tapos nila ginawa yung sarili niya ng fake mustache, tapos shades para lang maiba siya kay ano Mark Heathcliff. Just good. <laughs> oh, Alex, you absolute bastard. <laughs> Woo! Bang klase. <laughs> okay, let's get back to the video. That you were hoping that I would be able to recover the contents of all of the tapes that you sent in, along with your request note. I was only able to recover maybe about two minutes from one of them. Oh. I'll be copying my recording of it onto this one right after this. I, I mean, I hope this helps you with the rest of your investigation. If you need any more help, you can call me back or just send me another letter and I'll be waiting a response. Okay. I know your video, Nan. Let's see. Ah, oh, Shiza! Ano yan? Ano maskara yan? <laughs> the might of the subconscious. Hello. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can fucking hear you, man. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> now, you may be thinking, who is this voice speaking to me through my television set? <laughs> well, yeah. Let who me the fuck are you? Myself. My name is Stanley. It is Hi, Stanley. Nice to meet you. Consider me a friend. Because nah, I screw you. You want to. I like having friends. How many friends do you have? No, thank you. I'm an autistic That's person true. and I don't want to have any Would friends other than mind? my future wife. I can make friends appear out of thin air. Okay, bye ka. You want to know how? <laughs> Not well, really. But you have to promise me that I am one of your friends first. No, thank you. Great. First, we must consider what makes up a good <laughs> friend. What do they sound like? What do they look 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 like? It is best to put it is best to put it is best. Oh, nag glitch, nag glitch, nag glitch. <laughs> They're just as scared as you are. Okay. Have a friend in mind? Great. <laughs> I think it's time to meet your new friend. 
Now just close your eyes and think really hard about your new friend. Aw, oh, nine. <laughs> Sorry, nag german na pala ako. Sorry. <laughs> Konti lang alam ko. I think it worked. Your new friend is somewhere in your house. <laughs> oh, really? Magisa na ako dito eh. <laughs> and I would love to be alone. Thank you, Stanley. Oh, who's this? Thatcher Davis, Jude Murray. Victim 5, vi victim 6? Not really. Please. You gotta help me. There's no one in my house. I don't know what to do. Creepy kind. Oof. It's gonna be fine. You need to calm down. Okay. All right. Um. Does this man resemble anyone you know by chance? No. What? Ooh. I have never seen anyone in my life that looks anything like him. Oh, that's creepy, man. What? Sending over one of our officers. Just don't hang up, okay? Eh. <laughs> I'm just got a 1015. I'm heading over to the place now. Damn it. Okay. Um. Parang parang mag body o mag partner tungsi ane. Teniente Davis kasi sa rento ano Weaver. I apologize for the silence, sir. What's your address? Wow. No wala na. No wala na. What are you talking about? Where's the others? The officer that was already checking out the place just pussied out. Natakot! Natakot yung... Natakot yung isang... Isang kaparo nilang polis. Oh, man. Ito yung ano ha. Sa intruder alert na ano video ha. Threat level, evident. Threat level, none. <laughs> Threat level, obvious. <laughs> Nothing of interest came out of the automated camera setup. We'll need to resort in an own in-home expansion with Weaver as soon as possible. Okay. And then after that, an mangyare. Okay, so recorded video or recorded ano? Parang body cam shot. Okay, toys. Stay behind. Okay. Oh, ito yung ano? Ave Maria ni ano? Alessandro something yung castrato na ano? Na matanda na ano? Na komanta ng ano? Ave Maria ni ano, ba ni Guno. <laughs> Nasa intruder alert. My goodness. Oh, Shiza. Oh, Shiza. Distraught at the sight of her missing infant. Distraught at the sight of her, of her missing infant. Uh, let's shoot camera. Weaver. Hello, Kona. No, wala na si Weaver. Weaver's down. She might have been killed by the alternate. Replace Steven. Hello? Hello? Oh, Shiza. <laughs> Inulit na yung ano po. Investigation. I need you to identify yourself. <laughs> yung <laughs> yung si Sammy niya no that should be Oh, that's not that's a bad Look. sign, man. Get the fuck out. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Was that the 
video something. Ah, oh, Shiza. Uh, yung... What do you yan want? Yung... Yan yata yung ano tawag nila. Oh, Shiza. Oh, shit! <laughs> yung para yung sa volume mo na yung tumatakbo tapos biglang yung banta! <laughs> oh, John Newton's gonna be pissed. The alternate just sang his hymn Amazing Grace. Oh, you come I. Ah, well, Anna, it's gonna follow you to the station, Lieutenant Davis. <laughs> Goodness gracious me. <laughs> Woo. Uh, <Brrr>. nah. <laughs> I'm not really scared. I'm actually amused. You know that? Okay. What is just from the station, I guess? From the CCTV cameras? 1078, requesting backup. Okay. Nagra-rage na ng backup si ano, Lieutenant Davis. 1078, requesting backup. Wait lang, wait lang, wait lang. Um, ano ibig sabihin ng 1078? Kasi ang alam ko, in R10 codes, ah, uh, 1070 narin narinig ko sa ano sa radyo ibig sabihin noon sunog 1052 um ano yun uh ito ambulance accident eh accident na kailangan respondihan ng ano ng ambulansya but what's 1078 let me just check that out goodness gracious me <laughs> i am i am basically researching on the freaking fly then 78 meaning so 1078 means uh, you need assistance or you need to send an ambulance that's a police code so basically uh you need uh, no, you need assistance uh kumbaga requesting backup so you know basically you know just sabi ni Lieutenant Davis dito sa radio um radio transmission yeah let's get back to the video Static. 1018 requesting assistance from available bystander news. Wait lang. Okay. So ang ang ibig sabihin naman ng 1018. Ne ne ne. Di 1010. Di 1010. 1018. 1018 code meaning urgent. Ano ibig sabihin nito? Yeah, this is an urgent ano. Hindi, not equipment exchange. Urgent, uh... Ano ibig sabihin ng 1018? Ano ibig sabihin? Okay, policecodes.net. Okay, so, basically, I'm just, uh, <laughs> uh, researching on the freaking fly on this recording. 1018 means, uh, urgent or complete present assignment, a uh, complete present assignment as soon as possible. I'm not sure if this is even uh, the true meaning or this is even the correct meaning, but I guess, ano, ga, parang yun yung ano dun, uh, requesting, ano, requesting assistance then, but from an outside, ano, from an outside department. Now, for some context, kasi, uh, ang police siya sa, ano, sa America, it's dis decentralized. So, every county or in this, ano, in this, in the Filipino context, bawat, ano, bawat, bawat bayan, bawat, um, municipality may sari-sariling uh, uh, police departments so yung police uh, yung police sa isang ano county eh, hindi pwedeng uh, kung hindi pwedeng ano hindi pwedeng uh, uh, rumesponde sa kabilang county unless it's hot pursuit or nag-request ng backup yung county na yon yung police department ng county na yon so uh, TLDR that's the no that's the that's the explanation of everything uh, kumbaga, kasi dito sa ano natin sa context natin dito sa Pilipinas uh, the national police the, the national police is absolutely centralized and um, 
and since they come from a military background um you know ah uh, yung ano niya yung organization niya eh, medyo ano din medyo gendarmerie gendarmerie ang ano ang ang context it's such a shame that uh it's no no longer the case but anyway uh that's a to- another topic for another day let's get back to the video patapos na tayo let's go I'm hearing singing. I'm hearing some singing. This is an unauthorized use of Earth's normal. Identify yourself. Ooh. Lieutenant Thatcher Davis, MCPD. Static. 1018 requesting assistance from available worksheet units. <laughs> Basically, it's the alternates trying to, uh, no, trying to uh, jam the signals. <laughs> Ooh, the boobo si pituan. <laughs> Tapos tumutuloy na yung ano, yung pagkanta ng Amazing Grace. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Now I guess some congregations will no longer sing Amazing Grace at least in that tune <laughs> or in that hymn tune mag-iba na sila ng hymn tune siguro Africa ni William Billings or whatever yeah <laughs> goodness gracious me But I guess it's just it's just the first verse they're not singing all of the other verses like through many dangers toils and snares i, I have already come this grace i fought hindi ko na maalala yung yung uh yung isang verse doon or even uh, some of the verses the other, uh, on the other okay body cam again ni look at next oh shiza <laughs> oh my goodness Oh, Shiza! <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> uh oh! Bad decision, Thatcher! <laughs> oh my goodness, that's the pinaka. Oh, Shiza! <laughs> <laughs> Boom! Headshot! Still moving though! Ah! <laughs> Dude! There's not enough room for the two of us, Lieutenant! <laughs> Command and Conquer General's reference number two. <laughs> Yung workers sa GLA. <laughs> Oh, Shiza. <laughs> Alright, so <laughs> I had to pause it because uh, I have a lot. <laughs> Medyo na ano na ako. Na overwhelm ako dun sa ano na yun, sa uh, part na yun kasi ang daming nangyari. <laughs> Ito yung pinaka-climax talaga. And uh, yun nga, uh, <laughs> it's a lot to uh it's a lot to uh process <laughs> at naano na ako natatawa lang ako kasi uh yun nga ang daming ano ang daming nangyari uh that i mean that alternate is a first of its kind in uh Alex Kister's lore so yun lang naman yung ano ko uh, masasabi ko lang doon so let's finish up this video shall we let's go That face is so fucking creepy. Yun lang masasabi ko. <laughs> yeah. And we return to the eye. And that's it. <laughs> that's the end of the video. 
Well done, Alex Kister. Okay. So, um... Thatcher Davis was, uh... Voiced by Thornbaker. Wait lang, wait lang, wait lang, wait. Uh... I think Thornbaker, uh... Rings a bell. Kasi siya ang gum gumawa nung, ano... Nung, uh, Mandela Catalog-inspired, um... Short game na, uh, na Maple County. So, siya yata ang may ano nun, may gawa nun. And he just so happened to be the, uh, also the voice of the police officer in that game. So, siguro, ano din, nag, nagkataon lang din na ano siya, na, na um, nakikipag-collaborate sila ni, ano, ni, uh, ni Alex dito. And, uh, his screen name is Teenage Disaster. Uh, based on my research, kasi as I said, uh, napanood ko na tong video na to prior to this recording, uh, based on uh, the research uh, that I had, uh, Thorn Baker is also uh, a hip-hop artist. Uh, he does his uh, hip-hop tracks and uh, nagkataon lang na isa din to sa mga ano niya, side projects niya, yung Mandela Catalog, at least voicing out as ano, as Lieutenant Davis. So, nakakatuwa lang na ano, na may involved pa lang ano dito. May involved pa lang uh, recording artist dito sa mga voice actors natin ngayon. And it's um and it's actually uh an improvement from volume 2. Lahat tum lahat ng mga ano na to, mga voice acting na to. So, I guess uh Alex really ano, really did his homework regarding this. So, yun lang naman. Let's uh, finish up this video. So, uh, you all have all, uh, these people. Dave Lee was uh, voiced by Alex Kister himself. That's for sure. And then, uh, 3D modeling palang ginawa ni, ano, ni Thorn dito. So, uh, he not only... Uh, oh! Kaya pala familiar to. Kasi, um, si Stan Lee, uh, he was inspired by uh, Jim Henson's Limbo, The Organized Mind. Which hap who, who, who happened to be the one of the uh, characters from earlier episodes of Sesame Street? So at least may ano na may idea may idea si ano si Alex kung saan niya kinuha yon. And uh, let's finalize this. <laughs> the two of us, kung baga, ano, uh, since musician si Thorn uh, tinap din siya para don. Of course, special thanks to all his uh, patrons and Patreon. And he's thanking uh, so much for all the patience and support. So, yun lang naman. And I think meron pang, ano, meron pang eksena dito si, ano, si Alex eh. Kaya parang, ano eh. Ooh, that's, that's a little bit odd. Okay, so that's Jesus and uh, Simon, of, Simon of Cyrene car uh, carrying the cross. What's going wake on? Up, wake up, wake oh, wake alter up, alternate up. Gabriel's also there. <laughs> okay, I gotcha. I gotcha, Alex. You know the mama sabiko. Anyway, that's the end of the video. So, ah, uh, masasabi ko lang mga kababayan. Yeah, that was a good one. That was an absolutely good one. So, ah. Uh, this might not have any, you know, any, uh, um, anyon? edits at this point. Kasi, <laughs> I've been talking too much and, uh, mag-iisang oras na rin. So, maybe I can just cap it into one hour. That might, uh, that might be the thing. But anyway, uh, I would go ahead and, uh, uh, get this edited. Uh, it, it's much, you know, it's, uh, it's gonna be, uh, much easier on my end, kasi hindi ko na kailang magkaroon ng uh, uh, video cues at this point, kaya lang, syempre, I have to ready my ears for this. So, yun lang naman. Anyway, uh, that's the end of the uh, video for Mandela Catalog Volume 333. I would like to uh, con congratulate Alex Kister for this uh, for this video. So, yun lang masasabi ko. And, uh, I guess, ano, <laughs> Uh, I guess I'm very much, ano, I'm very much pleased with what I uh, saw here, uh, uh, entertainment-wise, huh? But uh, when it comes to spirituality, I might go to confession regarding this, because uh, 
uh, I don't know if it's uh, I don't know if uh, it, kaya lang kasi syempre it's uh, hindi na siya ano, eh, wala na siyang biblical ano eh, biblical undertones eh kasi although it has pero it's more in the church hymns uh, instead of ano instead of uh, biblical biblical stories although yun nga uh, singing it ni Alex sa band, sa pinaka ano pinaka pinakahuling part dun sa parte na eh, yung uh, image ni Jesus na uh, uh, binubuhat niya yung cross niya so yun yung ano don yun yung parang uh, biblical <laughs> overtone dun sa ano na yun sa buong video na yun so I guess that's all that I have to say at this point of this uh, video and um, Masasabi ko lang, uh, do watch or do check out um, uh, do check out Alex Kister's uh, YouTube channel. Uh, watch the whole thing. Uh, all of his videos. And uh, from my end, I'm cutting this video here. Again, if you like this video, if you uh, if you appreciated my uh, my piece regarding this, I would uh, invite you to subscribe to this channel. Ring the notification bell by selecting all. Like this video and sharing this video around in order for uh, in order for Alex and for other uh, other people who are uh, interested with the Mandela catalog to uh, watch a Filipino perspective regarding this. So yun lang naman yung sa akin. Again, if you are uh, if you are ve- uh, if you wanted to make uh, a financial ano a financial support if you're if you want to fina- uh, support me financially. Uh, there's Patreon, Buy Me a Coffee, Ko-Fi, and PayPal. The links to all of these sites are all are all in the description below. Also, uh, kung gusto niyo ng uh, mas marami pang cycling vlogs or uh, cycling uh, related activities, uh, follow me on Strava as well. It's Intrepid Ian Renyon. So yun lang naman ang sa akin at this point, and I'm gonna cut this here. So with all that said, this is Intrepid Ian Renyon reminding you to at all times be the salt of the earth and the light of the world. Until then, look alive, stay alive, be kind to yourself and uh, to others, and as always, thank you for watching. From Intrepid HQ, see you next time. Ian out. Yeah, but all the name drop. Sally wrote it. <laughs> now we have to go for the one. What do you want me to now find her some help with me? We'll be in the same sea line. No, it drove us on the other Monday. All of us in the bus in the back of life. Here we are. Even if it's no longer than I am, we make it. Here I am. Now it's so annoying. Wait, the ones that know that. the female. That looks more about what's going on. I'm here to help me off the city of Calf and then we should get half a six and give me a coffee and I was saying, yeah. That was saying, yeah. Drake's. No, I'll just arrive, but I'm going through it. Follow me, I'm going through it. I'm going through it when they get to the spots. <laughs> Wake up.